it doesn't start out well, but the next night you come right back out and win first. So that's kind of what it's all about here, right? Yeah, last night didn't start good, but you know we have an opportunity to go ten nights. So I just told myself to treat every road every night like a one header and see how much money I can win. We got up to a good start. What what happened last night's run? Can you just take us through it? Yeah, I just I didn't quite have the horse set right, and I knew the steer ran hard, and I just didn't get it going like I needed to. And so tonight I did a few different things, talked to some people. And, got things figured out. Can you take, tell us about some of those changes? Like, what, what was the difference? Just like last night, I kind of let Gunner leak off the corner a little bit when I nodded and didn't just get that clean leave. And I talked to the Jesse Peterson who owns him and some buddies of mine at home that watched it and we just kind of talked it over and played it out in my mind and then tried to do it out yeah. there. <laughs> what are the last 24 hours like? Do you just, well, obviously you study and look at it, uh, but do you try to forget about it a little bit uh, and just kind of move on to the next one? Yeah, I just had to forget about it. It was over, so I just had to move on to the next steer and you know just go after it try to do well. Tell us about Gunner a little bit and how did you decide to, to use that horse? Uh, he's a great horse I believe he's 22 years old and you know he's been coming here for a long time Luke Branquino's won a couple gold buckles on him and stuff and I had the opportunity to go down and practice at Luke's for a couple weeks beforehand and run a few steers on Gunner he's a great horse. Who's hazing for you? And Jason Miller's hazing for me he's a great hazer one of my best friends so it works out good. You know, this week so far, <laughs> the ups and downs, but what about outside the arena, you know, the family? What, what are you doing outside the arena? Yeah, I got a lot of family here. It feels good to have support from home and everything. There's a lot of people here, so everything's going good. Yeah. So when you have the way it's worked out, you know, first night to second night, now you have eight more. How do you view it? What, what's the mentality going forward here for the rest of the year? Yes, I'm going to try to get close to the barrier every night. That's been the biggest problem I've had coming down here in the last couple of years, so just try to keep getting good starts and hopefully it works out. Good. Congratulations. All right. Thanks.